Today we're going to get the basic trailer lights working on the 2018 Ford Transit. This is on the driver's side, the foot well area. I went ahead and removed that and you can see these two clips here. They're not plugged into anything. These are going to go into the travel brake control module. And then they're going to connect another wire to that little brain and attach it here. Then they're going to use this and go through this hole underneath the van and that's going to attach to the wires which are already installed. It seems kind of weird that they didn't put the brake module in even though they put the wires from the back all the way up to here and then they had the fuses in. The fuses for anything trailer related is underneath the steering wheel on the right hand side. Here we found that they were present and we pulled them out and tested them and they tested fine. Well, when I did a little research online, the reason why they did it is like the 2015s to the 20 like 17s. The trailer brake control module was catching on fire. So they had a recall on them. So how do you stop it from catching on fire? You just don't install it. It looks like their solution to the problem. So we're going to install it. But what we're going to do is we're going to add a weep hole. I looked to see if there was any little holes because it was catching fire because water was building up in the footwell area. So what we're going to do is we're going to drill right here and put a little weep hole, just a tiny hole to let water escape to prevent it from catching fire. And if you look underneath, we'll go here and we'll look right underneath to make sure it's safe. And then we can see that area is actually going to be right here that we're going to drill through. All right, so you can see we came through with the drill bit and we're just going to use a little rust preventative on that little hole right there. So the Ford Transit already came with the trailer hitch right there and it came with the four pin and the seven pin connected to it. And it also has the wires underneath that run all the way up to the front of the van. And to see if you have the travel brake control module installed, you just come right here on the driver's side, come right underneath, and then exactly underneath in that area. See the clip here that Ford's already installed? This goes to the back of the trailer hitch. All right, so what you're gonna do is, the clip underneath the van, you're gonna have to push this in and then slide it down. So there we go. So we push this in, push this in and pull this down. So once you do that, it comes out. And then after it comes out, you can see where it's gonna plug into right there. So as you can see circled in red, that is everything that Ford has installed. The next part, is what we have to install to connect the travel brake control module. This is the part you'll need with the part number. All right, so you can see the plug on the other side after we ran it. And we have our wire right here. That's the part number. So then you see it also has these little uh, hole plugs that you can attach to the holes. So I notice this one here, I'm going to take it, put it underneath here, and we're going to clip it into this hole. You can hear it go up in there. That's going to hold this in place. And we're going to go underneath here, and we're going to clip it into our clip until we hear a clicking sound. And then you're just going to push that in until you hear a click. There you go, hear that? So now we know that's solidly connected to the wires that run to the back of the trailer. All right, so come back up here. We know everything's plugged in underneath. We have our plug here. Do now, so let me get our plugs from here. We got all of our clips out right here. This plastic piece here, we're just gonna have to figure out a way to remove this because we might have to just break it. Now we got that little clip here taken out so that's what we're going to use to bolt it in so now we're going to actually clip everything in right here 
the big one that came that goes underneath the van you're just going to clip that in there until you hear a click and you can't get these wrong because the size clips are different sizes so you just plug them into the bottom here all right so now we have all of them all three things clipped in here put it in place on this back wall using the existing holes that were already there let's go ahead and get this bolted in all right and then we used a hex bolt and a hex nut in the existing holes to connect it so it was easier to take the bolt through the bottom and then have somebody tighten the nut up on the outside here but that's all you need this is the trailer brake module right here it's pretty much the brain so with this you actually have the capability to tow a trailer like this because this has no brakes on it so we don't need to install the brake controller so if you're tow towing just a small trailer this is all you need just install the wiring and the trailer brake module and plug it all in this took me less than 45 minutes so now we'll go ahead and put the footwell back and we can use our trailer if you need to tow a bigger trailer that has brakes on it and you need the trailer brake controller we're going to pop up the cup holder and we're going to get to this clip that's down here and install the trailer brake controller and then with that we're going to have to program it if we put this in so yeah i don't have to haul off-grid items in my van anymore now that i got the four pin trailer working it's all i need but when i do get the trailer brake controller installed and the seven pin working, I'll make a video for it.